Hey, hello everyone! Welcome back to Let's Play Close Combat Wacht am Rhein. I am your host, Lord Cucumber, and with me today is. Master! Look at me! Ah, wonderful, wonderful. Okay. Alright, well, uh, Master, as you can see, uh, the uh, the border here at. Uh, let's see, that must be. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Malmedy is still uh, is still pretty far to the east. The Germans haven't penetrated my line very well thus far, except for this little part where they actually managed to catch her, capture the uh, area. And the rest is still pretty much clear of Germans. And we get to move stuff. We are apparently awesome. in that point uh, of the game. I'm going to move the 101st Airborne, of course. They are going to move towards the Bastogne, which is the probably the most important location on this map. Let's see, where are, where are the other guys? Ah, here they are. So, they will be moving along this route here. There we go. And over here, like so. I think. Or, yeah, no, that's fine. And let's see. One okay. So, 504th, 82nd Airborne. Great. We'll just try and protect our center with these guys. Um, and there's right. another one. Still to move over there. There we go. And also, we need to move our stuff over here. Um, okay, so these guys have. Okay, let's see. I guess we should switch these guys out somewhat. Uh, we need to get um, the tanks to the front because these people are beginning to suffer got a bit of a scout group here against Kuhlmann who has like Panther G's and uh, uh, all kinds of nasties. Panzer Grenadieren. They'll be fighting I guess. Um, we'd better give them some artillery support in their next fight. There we go. And we'll move this tank group up down here. And this one will roll down here. Let's see what's up, what's going on up here. Oh yes. Yeah, there's a couple of German units there. We're gonna have to hold them off. Hopefully, we'll be able to plug that hole. This one hasn't moved yet. Um, what we could try and do is swing it around the side here, go over here. But that would leave a pretty large gap. We don't like gaps much. Ew. No, gaps are g gaps are are wrong. <laughs> uh, we've got a pretty m pretty sizable gap over here as well. Um, I'm going to have to ask the 28th Infantry to hold on for dear life, yeah. facing Kochen, who also brought some Panthers. And this is a scout group, we'll be fine against them. I guess I'll just support them as well with some fire support there. And we've also got another um, FB Brigade, I have no idea. <laughs> ah, um, we can give them some uh, regular mortar support will do that everywhere where we have some fights yeah everywhere it's gibt the Volksgrenadiers also not for not very long <laughs> anymore the Volksgrenadiers will die and what's this are you oh you're moving yes you're moving great fantastic um, I think I'll leave this um, this tank unit here, in case one of them break, one of those German units here breaks through. A Kampfgruppe Piper, I believe, is in here. That's why I'm not there. <laughs> he managed to push me out of that area. So Le Leidenborn is now in German hands. Well, good luck with it. Enjoy, <laughs> its, uh, enjoy its cheese and its many delicacies. I have no idea. Um, yeah. Okay, um, that's great. Okay, they've got... Okay, yeah, yeah. I've supported everyone with artillery support. I think we're just about ready to do this. There we go. Did he move anything into my area? He didn't. That moron. <laughs> okay, well, good luck with that. <laughs> there are, however, <laughs> uh, quite a few skirmishes along the line here. We'll have to wait and see. And the first one is going to be a slaughterhouse between the 106th Infantry Division and the 18th Volksgrenadiers. Now, Volksgrenadiers, as I have told in um, earlier uh, videos, are basically old men and boys 
uh, armed to the teeth. Um, in this particular scenario, by the way, because later on, when the fighting was going on in the streets of Berlin, Volksgrenadiers were guys who were lucky enough to own a single Panzerfaust, uh, a, a one-shot anti-tank weapon, and they were put up against Russian tanks. A pretty unfair fight. Anyway, with uh, f about five minutes of training. This is how you pull the pin out, aim, <coughs> fire. <laughs> that was about it. So, but these guys Oops, are in good spirits. That's not supposed to blow up. <laughs> that's not supposed to happen. We'll have a look at the opponent. They have a, a seven and a half centimeter uh, gun there. That one might be a problem, this one here. Uh, but the rest, Panzer Shrek, not too worried about that against the infantry. The rest is infantry, infantry, infantry. So there we go. Um, we've got a 3 inch AT gun which I am going to remove and replace with a uh, 30 caliber machine gun. There we go. That ought to do it. Uh, do uh -huh. we any teams that we need replaced? I don't think this bazooka uh -huh. team needs this. Yeah, this I was about to say that. There we, we go. Need them get a BAR team in there. I guess that will work uh, a lot better, don't you think? Yes. Okay, now these teams here with the yellow smiley thing, they've got wounded, but they're still capable of doing quite a bit of damage. So I'm going to leave them there. I'm not going to replace them. They'll be, they'll be just fine. They might get killed. Ah, uh, looks okay. Yeah. All right. Battle continues. Apparently I was already fighting them in this area. Ah, yes I was. Yeah, they sort of managed to secure this little corner here. Poor guys. Um, I'm just going to do it uh, by the line, as in I'm going to put these guys, where are they, here we go. Can you see any of this? Do you, do you yeah, I can. It's just really white. <laughs> I could imagine it being, uh, oh, okay. All right, I'm just going to put these guys up here on ambush, there we go. I've done this many times before. Um, one, of the, uh, one of the drawbacks of the game is that you get to do these things an awful lot in the same areas but right now doesn't matter much there we go we've got a where is it what is this where is it i don't see it um, um that's oh, all right it's, on your screen it's there, in yeah. the trench there which is a pretty good spot by the way i might put them there anyway uh but no not for now and uh, do you have can you see down this area here yes you can good excellent um, Yes, we'll be able to stop the Germans, which is what we're here for. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we can't have them capture our favorite place to do survival. <laughs> <laughs> do paintball. <laughs> and paintballing and, uh, and all that good stuff. We can't have that. No, we can't. I'm going to put these guys up here on ambush, I guess. Looking sort of north-ish. There we go, uh, like down this road. So these guys are sec to secure that area, hopefully. Got a platoon leader <laughs> here for the next uh, thingy, me jigger. Uh, they're gonna do the center. The center is gonna be hit hard. Uh, okay. I, I already know that from previous uh, fights here. You can see the rubble. Uh, yeah. That's sort of my fault. Um, yeah. Did you mortar your own troops there? No, but he does have that seven and a half centimeter gun. Oh, and it makes short work of anyone not uh, um, in, um, outside of its range. Basically, anything they can see, they'll fire at and become um, dangerous. There we go. Just no. I want to put you in the trench. In the trench. In the trench. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, these guys are uh, mortar guys, so I'm not going to put them anywhere um, in a in an exposed spot. Uh, I'll put the 30 caliber machine gun up here because wow, this is nice. Mm, good shooting here, eh? There we go. I can, I can, yeah. I can push them, on, put them in ambush for now. Um, the enemy has to come to us. Oh, no, oh, I'm sorry. Urgur, mader. There we go. Yeah, with that machine gun set up there, we might think about uh, having a meatpacking plant nearby. <laughs> <laughs> yes! An awesome <laughs> idea. What are you laughing about? I was serious. I mean, uh, we could uh, haul the dead bodies uh, as food, as, as burgers. 
like McDonald's does. Hamburgers. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there might be some hamburgers there and some people from Leipzig and oh, all over the place. Uh, yeah. yeah, who knows? Huh. Uh, I don't. Let's see. Um, we've got a, th a third platoon, which I suppose we want to put here on the right flank. I'm always a bit, bit, a bit annoyed by this flank. Engineer team, there we go. You boys, keep an eye on that uh, area there. Uh, why did I move that engineer team? Oh, I wanted to move the platoon leader, but I missed. Whoops! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that happens. Uh, you're gonna be in here. I'm bushing. There we go. 30 caliber machine gun. Now that's an important one. I don't know. I, we have one in the middle now. But what we want, ideally, is another one uh, aiming at the church. I guess I'll put him in here. That won't matter much, will it? Nah. Uh, we've got a beer. Yeah, good. Yeah, I think it. I, I mean, I can put up a tight defense. And I think think, yeah, that's our BAR team right there. Oh, I moved them. <laughs> Oops, I moved them. Ha ha ha. Ah, yes. Uh, BAR team, they're going to be in the shit because they're going to be like right on top of this church, which is where our enemy is probably going to try and get. And did we move everyone now? No. Nope, that last one. That's the, uh, we can move a forward team into the church. We can actually make a nice defensive position there. If we want, yeah, we might want to have them pull pull some fire but in. <coughs> why why don't you uh, put one machine gun team uh, in the church? Ah, uh, two things. One, uh, infantry guns. <laughs> They're gonna shoot at the first thing that comes close by, and I don't want them to be a right. machine gun team. Uh, although it is a nice idea to put a rifle team up here and put the machine gun up there. <laughs> anyway, there we go. Uh, I'll, I'll put these f these ones are going to be in the action almost instantly. So I'll put these guys on this side on the fence for the time being. All the other ones are going to be on ambush. There. Well, let's right. do it. Let's do this. Leroy! Begin! Jenkins! <laughs> And wow, they're immediately and they're in the forest here. I'm just gonna open up. Oh, hello. The pew pew. Got a rifle team cowering. I know. I'm just defending now. Come on. Damn! I'm moving fast up here into the uh, into that area there. Oh my God! There's killing going on here. It's amazing. Okay, you guys, fire with the 60, 60 millimeter mortar. Do your fang. And there we go. There is their um, yeah. Our mortars are. Whoa! Yep, yeah, we took uh, we took them out. The gun nice. is gone. The gun is totally gone. Well done! We're suppressing the Germans in the forest as well. I'm trying to take down their own mortar team now. So far so good. I've got a rifle team cowering. Oh, those guys! Nah, they're not cowering, they're firing. Ah, good. Yes, the 8 centimeter uh, mortar gun is now uh, also fucked. There we go. You guys are in uh, open terrain. That's gonna hurt. <laughs> yeah, we turned one inside out. Cool. My favorite. Oh, oh, they're moving to attack us through the forest. And not anymore, because we turned the trees inside out. <laughs> gonna put some fire onto these guys, they're out in the open. Oh, their, their mortars are still firing. Ah, from here. Found them now. 
There we go. <laughs> Turn one of them more guys inside out. He's over here. Active. Yes. Ah, oh, yes, yes, yes. The, the German invention of tree burst. It's, uh, it's a. It's a. It's a. It's a gift, really. All right. Back here, it's pretty quiet. I'm gonna move my platoon leader up into this rubble here and get him in set up. And uh, so far, so good. These folks, grenadiers, never knew what hit him. These guys are in the open. I'm gonna try and fire at them. The rifle team is still cowering. One wonders why. Honestly, why? It doesn't ma make any sense. Oh, no, are they uh, out in the open? Uh, relatively speaking. Uh, relatively. Ah. Unconscious. Oh. That doesn't help. One of our mortar teams took a direct hit and they're unconscious. Oh. Ew! Yeah, that doesn't help. You're busy? Really now? Oh, he's out of ammo. Oh, okay. Eh. Just move to this block hop here and get him. There's a machine gun here somewhere. I'll try and move to this house here. Hopefully, we'll be okay. Whoa, they still have one of those guns operational? Really? Or is that a mortar? I thought, thought they only had one. Yeah, I think they, all, they did. Come on, give me some smoke. Maybe smoke. you should uh, relocate that rifle team that's uh, still carrying. Yeah. I'm gonna a ask for a smoke mission here. There we go. Move in there. Go. Run. Now I'm trying to get these guys over here on the right flank in into that little um, little area there. So hopefully they'll they'll be okay. Dropping in smoke. There we go. DIR team. All four of them. <laughs> oh wait, there's another one coming. Okay, cool. <laughs> wait for me, guys! Well, that definitely worked. Maybe we can get the uh, engineers in there as well. You guys keep moving. Go. I only didn't. I only needed a little bit of smoke. <laughs> oh no, that's not our guys. Hey, no. they're no longer uh, cowering. No, they're not, because they managed to survive against quite a few guys. Ah, good. Last mortar round definitely helped. Oh, there's guys going through the forest here. Oh, it's a Panzer Kill track. them! Yep, that was our last mortar uh, ammo. Oh. We are definitely getting there because we're getting to this house. And we, once we get this house, we're gonna cut them off from here. It's gonna be awesome, man. According to the map, they don't have a lot of uh, teams left. No, they don't. And we are really, really killing them off now. Yep, here we go. Engineers are taking this house. Oh, an excellent move for my uh, engineers there. Get him! 
Yeah! I'm gonna move that BAR team in here. Once the smoke clears, they'll have a perfect shot. I think those Volksgrenadiers are gonna find that uh, life is uh, pretty terrible uh, if you engage an American unit. Oh, yes, total American victory. There we go. <laughs> wow, we did it. <laughs> and I didn't even use so the special the, mortar the attack. <laughs> Hmm? Did the uh, the lever uh, access units did they uh, get out of there or no, are they no, no, now no. captured? They look at the, the the description here because it says it all. The battle ended because the access forces were destroyed or routed. We gained control of the entire area. The access forces were unable to retreat and were forced to disband. Woohoo! Ah. We actually made prisoners on this one. Zupa. All right. So, uh, usually you do two battles in one go, but uh, that means we actually control this area now, again. Uh, where is it? Yes! Here we go. Ah! The uh, Hapsheet area is now ours. Awesome. Wait. I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna pull these guys out. They've been on the line for a very long time. If I can swap these around, I will. Uh, next time I can get to move. Now we get to fight against Kochen and his Panzer... Panther, jeez, jeez, man. I think I'm going to lose this one, by the way. Actually, I'm quite sure I might. Um, oh boy. Yeah, I don't have stewards. I don't have three-inch anti-tank guns. I don't have 57 millimeter anti-tank guns. The only thing I have is bazooka guys. Oh, and a heavy millimeter mortars. And a har heavy artillery, uh, heavy, he uh, a heavy artillery strike. Yeah, but those 81 and 60 millimeter mortars don't really help against uh, uh, Panthers. You'll see. No! The battle continues. Ah yes, I was actually being pushed back here, I remember now. It was it was bad news bears. I did take down a lot of these uh, uh, enemy tanks though, so that's nice. But I have a feeling... <laughs> It's not gonna end that well this time, <laughs> for some reason. All right, the top team. The top team are gonna do a strike here. Uh, I guess. Uh, what do we do? I don't know. I don't know. Ambush. There we go. I'm just gonna let them get close. I'm just gonna get everyone on the line into ambush. Uh, that bazooka team needs to go somewhere else. I think I'll just. I'm gonna not. I'm not gonna deploy a, 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 as a unit. I don't see the any good purpose to do that right now. Uh, 30 caliber machine gun though, that's interesting. We want to put those guys somewhere where they can actually look down the road. Can they see everything? Yes, they can. Okay, cool, nice, thank you. They'll probably get blown away by the Panthers the moment they see them, but... <laughs> yeah, I don't know really, that's that's how it goes, I'm serious. Um, Cannon faller. Uh, yeah, really. I, I, I have... Um, I have a very strong feeling <laughs> we are going to lose this battle really quickly. But well, you know, that's just, you accept that to happen. Okay, they have to cross this bridge with the tanks. If they don't, they are not going to go anywhere. So, what we'll, we'll do is put a, a bazooka team here as well. Just on ambush, uh, down the road, there we go. And do they have any line of sight? They don't because of the tank racks. But we might want to do this, and then they can see what's going on here. So if somebody comes down the road here on the bend, we'll be able to uh, blow it away. I could consider simply abandoning the western, uh, the eastern half of the map, for in favor of just trying to hold out here until the tanks get there. So. That might be best. And they will in uh, try to get there um, using I our um, infantry. But... Um, there we go. Put this one on ambush. Hope for the best. <laughs> Alright. And these guys going to be in here. It's a rifle team on ambush. There we go. I think there's going to be Germans right, right away in this darkened area. Generally speaking, they're going to try and put their tanks in this area here. I think. So, might not be the best idea to put this one over there. 
Um, it's very likely that they'll try and um, make a break for it um, now that they've secured the bridge because they have. Um, that doesn't mean we shouldn't protect that part. See, we've got mortars. Um, I guess I'll put these mortars in here on ambush. Put the platoon leader in this little area here. He's just gonna sneak around, and if any Germans come, he's gonna open fire. There we go. Put these guys on the hill here on ambush. Hopefully, nobody sees you. Unlikely, but possible. And we have another 81. Well, I have a lot of mortars on this map. Wow. I'll just put you guys down here. There we go. On ambush. And we've got another platoon leader here. Hmm. Yeah, on in here. On ambush. And the rifle team. The last rifle team. Ah, oh, man. We are thinly spread here. Like too, yep. mu too much butter. <laughs> thinly spread like too much butter. Yeah. I like it. <laughs> you like everything. Begin! Oh, oh, oh dear. Hello. Hi. Oh, we can't actually fire at you, but we were, we're damn sure are gonna try. Because that is a tank, and I want it dead. Barrage is available immediately. That's awesome. Try and drop it here if you can. Oh. Yeah. Ah, good. Oh, well, I got good news and got bad news. The bad news is our artillery strike is a bit late, but we did take down a tank with it. Okay, that's cool. It is cool. And we've now caught the, the attention of this panther. Oh boy. Yeah. That's not necessarily bad. But and the BAR team is really in trouble now. Oh dear. Oh dear. The uh, bazooka guy got blown up there. Yeah. Should have gone into a recording booth. City up. Yes. Oh, our men are starting to panic. That's horrible. Probably has something to do with the amount of freaking panthers on <laughs> on our asses. Yes, this looks especially uh, dangerous. <laughs> it does. Actually. I'm gonna try and retake this uh, town square here. There we go. Oh, there's just a couple of panthers there. Oh my god. You're so going to die now. I no longer have a bazooka team to kill these tanks off, so... You're under heavy fire. Well, at least I, I seem to have um, done something to these panthers. <laughs> Oh dear. Well, the interesting thing is... They're not uh, exactly um, attacking us just yet here. Oh dear. Some of my guys have surrendered. Bad news. Very, very bad news. Oh no, the 30 caliber guys are leaving. Ermigerd. Oh, they got shot. Oh, there's nothing left on this north port side. Oh boy. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, here, here, please, here. Oh man, that was <laughs> close. I was almost aiming at my own guys. That would have been bad. Yeah, as if the tanks weren't bad enough. Why aren't they moving uh, up, up their uh, other tanks? 
I don't know. Because they're stupid. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. Just gonna move up. There we go. Got a uh, half track? Yeah, I've just blown it up. I'm blowing up the crew now. Or trying to. I'm actually making quite a bit of... Whoa, what are you guys doing over there? Enemy spotted. Ah, good. We turned them inside out. <laughs> Outside in! Murder! Oh, come on. You're, you can't be that brave. It's impossible. Nope, we've lost everyone on this northern end. We have lost every single guy here. Alright, there's still a blue speck on the map. Yeah, probably somebody who um, is firing mortars, of course. Makes perfect <laughs> sense. They're out of ammo, so I'm going to move them to this little house here, sneakily. Hopefully... Oh, hello! Germans in the open, guys! Haha! <laughs> that took them out! We are actually making a dent in the German uh, line here. Despite the fact that... Um, oh, wow! That yeah, we are definitely making an impression here. That's nice. Except for their tanks. Yeah, yeah, they made an impression on us. Do you still have anything left that could... Uh, yeah, we've got an entire southern flank here that could move in and do stuff. But I doubt against they'll tanks? be... Uh, yeah, I doubt they'll be very effective against you tanks, exactly. Oh, just... There is a clear path. Don't mm -hmm. give me that. There we go. Sneak up here. I'm just gonna try and sneak up into this little village area here and see what I can see. And hopefully, that will help some. I'll try and sneak up here and see what's going on. Put you guys on defense, I guess. There we go. Nobody takes this. Hmm. Never mind. A minor German victory. We're still there, <laughs> but uh, barely. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Battle ended <laughs> because Allied morale broke. The Axis captured some ground before the Allies could regroup. Both sides still control some victory locations. The Axis won a battle because they control a greater number of crucial victory locations than the Allies. Let's look at the details on this one. Um, we did damage three of their armor. And we took one of their vehicles out. Not very good. And then there's a bunch of infantry that I don't care about. And we lost a lot of infantry. Yes. Two were taken Two prisoner. prisoner. Oh. <sighs> oh well. It happens. Alright, but we're still there, I said. And I'll be able to reinforce them soon with these guys. I haven't moved them because I wanted to see if I can make a dent in these guys uh, without moving them. Apparently not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. And I need to take care of this as well. Uh, this meet this has still got an uh, armored group in it, so um, they might break through and then we're in trouble. But uh, I think I'm gonna call it an episode for these two battles. Uh, next time we'll be uh, joining the remains of the 28th infantry over here. Well, they're still in a pretty good shape considering, and they'll be facing these uh, this mixed group of Panzer IVs and half tracks and Flammenwerfer and packs and all kind of panzer pioneer lovely they'll be uh, just dandy do you have any You'll anything be on to fire uh, yeah we'll, that will be on fire all right quite literally <laughs> anyway thank you all for joining us in this particular case um bucket smith thank you for joining me no problem and do you have anything uh, to add to this wonderful thing 
Um, no, it's been very exciting. So exciting uh, that I uh, didn't have time to uh, <laughs> speak up. <laughs> yeah, uh, I do have a tendency to rattle on. Uh, might want to change that for next time. Anyway, thank you for joining <laughs> us. <laughs> See you then. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Goodbye.